Last video I got these six danger hearts, so and these are like the sheep people, they're like cat people. They're really cool. I don't know. But I didn't play as them because I like playing as a lizard man. So yeah. I'm fast traveling to Windhelm Stables. Basically I'm just trying to get Ebony Ingot so I can make Daedric armor. So that's all I need left is just like twenty seven of them or like thirty, I don't know. I do steal some by the end of the video. You just, I, I didn't clip it. I don't I didn't think I needed to. So yeah, I just travel. I basically have to go there. So yeah. This is just like a bunch of orcs. Pretty cool. This is just off this mountain. Mm, yeah. And heard a dragon sound, and I got pretty scared because I don't have my cool armor yet. I didn't even make it because I need to get the, at the mine for it. Yeah, we're just, we just have to go a bit more up the mountain. And boom, it'll be there. It's right there. And I went back because I realized I went too far. In order to get to the mine, it's actually connected through there. So I have to talk to the orcs to let me in. Yeah. Halt, Outlander. By the code of Malakath, this stronghold belongs to the orcs. Your kind are unwelcome. This is our stronghold. Here, we are free to live as Malakath intended, away from the prying eye. You're not an orc or blood king, so stay out. Hmm. We've heard whispers of an enchanted pair of gauntlets, hidden and protected by dangerous men, beasts, or worse. They are called the Forge Master's Fingers. Bring them to our chief, and he will decide if you are worthy to be blood kin to the orcs. We will see. So she says I have to go and get this, because I'm not an orc, nor blood-related. And then I found these magic people, and I killed this one girl. Head into, then I head to, into the cave. So uh, for order me to even get in, and to even let them think about letting me join, I have to get them these, like, uh, gauntlets. Pretty cool. But I didn't know what I was getting into, though. So I saved the game, just in case if I die. Yeah. Now, I fight this one guy. It's pretty easy. He's a novice. So, and I stole potions. But I did not know what I was getting into. I thought this was pretty difficult. This is my least boys. But now. Nah. I found this fire thing with a wolf, which is like a ghost. And I, oh, I almost ate my danger heart. I almost did. But if that would happen, I just I would have really saved. Then I put on my pissed skin. Basically, since I'm a lizard man, um, basically it just gives me like health for like a minute. So I use that. That you can only use that. If you're an Agonian, and I'm a lizard, so I use it. Then I found this giant ice man. Yeah. yeah I got scared, so I kind of went back a little bit. Yeah, then. I think. Yeah. And then I was trying to like, kill this one man. I, I was after him. And I was. And then he just. Yeah. Then I put a level up. So he got help up. Nothing is wrong. He was just too strong. I was telling him to get him low, and then I just died. I just died. The guy just threw a fireball at me. Yeah, so I had a different plan. I was thinking, okay, I'm just gonna get in there, run past them, get the gauntlet, and just get out. And that's, so that's my new plan. Instead of just killing him. So I just ran past the first guy. And then ran past the... Uh, second goal, I think, and I drunk some, yeah, I drunk some stamina, but then I went the wrong way, and then this lava thing, fire thing, got in my way, and blocked me, luckily this guy comes through, so he told, like, a bit to the left, and I got past, I almost died, 
So then I just kept on going. Ass, ass. And then this Iceman was in the way. But he looked to get out the way. Stupid for him. But then I got the gauntlets. And I found this beacon, which I didn't pick up because I know it's a bad, bad mission. It was, it was, yeah. yeah, I'll probably do it later. Then this guy started chasing me. The Iceman started chasing me. So I jumped down and I exit the cave super fast. And I ran away. And that's that. I left the cave. It was pretty cool. So I head back. And then this tiger just started attacking me. Big ass cat just started trying to eat me. I almost died. I almost died. But then he started ran running away. Give me enough time to heal. But he almost killed me, but I killed him. Obviously. Because I'm a beast in this game. So then I leveled up so some else won't try to kill me. So yeah. Now all we have to do is get back to the orcs and let them let us in so we can mine finally. So they let us in. And then I have to talk to like the king of the whole place. So here you go. Hey, leader. You found the Fort Master's papers. You impressed me, Outlander. No one else has returned with this task before. By the code of Melikan, I named you Bloodkin to the Orcs. Let it be known among the strongholds that you are family now. Feel free to trade with our Smiths for Orc weapons and armor. Train with my warriors. Or purchase poisons from the wise woman. So then we just start heading to the mine so we can get the ingots. So yeah, I actually stole some. Not on the way, but after I started mining the entire cave, which I did, you, you'll see that. I stole all of it, and it had just enough to make the armor at the end. But you'll see me um, mining, so, yeah. Then I stole this pickaxe. And then everyone just started bullying me because I'm an Argonian and because I'm an outsider. Even though the king always said I'm um, now blood to them. So I just stopped mining the whole cave. One point, like, uh, the cave almost collapsed. It was insane. I, I, I almost left, but I really wanted to get all the ingots because I spent hours to get to this moment. But yeah, this is just like two minutes of me just mining. Nothing really happens. So yeah, I'm just mining, mining, mining. More mining. Yeah, I'm, I mined the entire cave and got every single piece and I stole a few. So yeah, um, I'm just keep on mining and get every single piece because trust me it is worth it man like all the hours I spent grinding just to do this just to get to this moment is so worth it trust me at the end of the video it's gonna be so satisfying getting the best armor in the game probably not the best stats because obviously um, I want some stuff to be challenging I don't want to be basically a god so yeah Every orc learns the heavy labor of mining. I'll spend years in the cave. Also, everyone just brags as I mine, like how like much their life is harder than mine. Like how much more work they do. <laughs> yeah, they just brag saying I'm weak basically. And that they're just so much stronger and that they do more work than me. Probably because they're stupid enough and they do, probably don't get anything. So yeah.
Yeah, by me getting to work on mine. The plan is to get those people back in Lockersburg and take over. Mool is the smart kid. I go where he tells me. Got something just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. You might take a look. Yeah, I'm just looking for, like, blacksmith potions just to make my armor. I don't find any, and it doesn't really matter. So, yeah. yeah There's just nothing here. I didn't find anything I wanted, so I just left. I, I don't know what I'm doing. But yeah, I just leave. Never mind. Hey! <laughs> Alright, now I leave. And look at this. This is gonna be super satisfying. Okay, never mind. I don't. I don't. What am I doing? Okay, I checked to see if he had any potions I needed, and I guess he didn't. So I'm collecting leather strips, as you can hear. And look at this! Look at this! Oh my gosh! I, I'm getting all. The, I'm getting the best arm in the game. Look at this! It's so satisfying. Look what I do here. I upgrade it to legendary. It does more damage. It's insane. Look what I do to the armor. Look at this! Look at this! I, I get that to legendary. And oh my gosh, watch me put it on. Just watch me put it on. Look at this. Look at me. I'm insane. I, I look amazing. This is what the armor looks like. I'm basically invincible, but not for like, I can still die from some stuff, so it's still gonna be challenging. That's the bow. I didn't make the arrows. Uh, I didn't think I need it. So yeah, this is what I look like without the, um,. Arrow sleeve thing.